Hello everybody. Welcome to the revised version of the tutorial number one. Today's subject is basic division. First, let me explain the concept of Kijopo method. First exercise is 15 divided by 3. Here is 10. 10 divided by 3 equals 3 with the remainder 1. So remove 1 here and add 3 here at the same rod. And add the remainder at the lower rod. Then 6 is here. 6 divided by 3 equals 2. So remove 6 here and add 2 here. Now calc is done. What I did just now is very close to Kijoho method. Although the mental arithmetics used here are not part of this method. Go back and look at the simulator. Enter 15 by 3 and click start. Avacus shows up here and the division table is down here. The components of this table are called division keys which are main tools for division calculation. There are color classifications for the division keys. Red figures show replacement values while blue figures show addition values. When applying these division keys 10 digit numbers such as 3 and 6 correspond to calc rod. 100 digit numbers such as 1 and 2 correspond to the upper rod. 1 digit numbers such as 3 and 6 correspond to lower rod. First calc digit number is 1. Instead of saying 10 divided by 3 equals something something, we use division key 1 over 3 is 31, which means replace the calc digit with 3 and add 1 to the lower rod, like this. Quotient part of the numbers on the abacus are displayed with lighter color so that they are clearly recognizable. Now the calc digit number is 6. Instead of saying 6 divided by 3 equals 2, we use the key 6 over 3 is 200. So subtract 6 from the calc digit and add 2 at the upper rod, like this. Now calc is done, and we've got the same result as before. So from now on, we'll use the division keys rather than those mental arithmetics. It can go backward by pressing back button, like this. This simulator shows next division keys, previous division keys, next calc rod, previous calc rod, and the end of the calc marks as well as the calc itself. 
Next exercise is 364 divided by 7. First calculate digit is 3. The key for 3 over 7 is 42. So replace the calculate digit with 4 and add 2 at the lower road, like this. Next character digit number is 8. The key for 8 over 7 is blank, not defined. In such cases, we use the one above it, which is 7 over 7 is 100. So subtract 7 from the character digit and add 1 to the upper road, like this. Next key is 1 over 7 is 3, so add 3 at the lower road, like this. Next calculate digit is 7, so we use the key 7 over 7 is 100. Subtract 7 from the calculate digit and add 1 to the upper road, like this. Now calc is done. Now go down and do these exercises manually by the online abacus. First one is 15 divided by 3. 1 over 3 is 31. 6 over 3 is 200. Now calc is done. And go to the second one, which is 364 divided by 7. 3 over 7 is 42. 7 over 7 is 100. 1 over 7 is 3. 7 over 7 is 100. Now the second exercise is done. I think you have noticed that this method heavily relies on the division keys. It could be a burden for some to memorize them or look up the table each time for the abacus operation. But wait, don't give up. At lesson 5, I will explain division with chanting which substantially alleviate this problem. You can have an access to the simulator and the online abacus by clicking the URL in the explanation column. That's it for today. Thank you for watching.